going to do part two of my champagne series look now that we have the champagne eyes snatched and the champagne accessories on point we are now going to focus on lips I am going to be reviewing two viral products this holiday season and I'm going to tell you baddies if they're worth your money and which one is superior so Let's get on into it. I have seen this everywhere on TikTok. I've seen it everywhere online. I had to order it immediately. The MAC Fizzy Feels Lip Balm in Taste for Bubbles versus the Tarte Maracuja Lip Plumping Gloss. They have sold out pretty much everywhere. I have been waiting for this product for a week. It finally shipped to me. If you wanna see if these products are worth your while and which is superior, continue watching. <laughs> This is the MAC packaging, very holiday. Love the packaging on this. And this is a lip balm. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. This is Taste for Bubbles. They also had a blue version, but I wasn't drawn to that one. Obviously, I'm a champagne girly, so this one called to me, and I thought it would be perfect for this look. She's so pretty. Even just to look at, I'm like, huh. The Maracuja lip shimmers have a ton of colors, and so I picked one that I thought would be similar to the Taste for Bubbles since we're doing a face-off. So this is the Maracuja Lip Plump. This is what the product looks like. Anyways, this is their Lip Plump packaging, which I love. This is my favorite lip gloss at the moment, the Maracujas. So what you do is it comes in this tube and then you literally click the product up. So let's see what this looks like. This is in the color Copper Rose, which I picked this one out because I thought it was the most similar to the Taste for Bubbles in terms of undertone and color in general. So if you look at them, so pretty. Let's zoom in up close and personal. So I'm gonna take off, taking off the chapstick. Okay, I'm going to line a little bit just so we can kind of see the outline of my lip. I don't overline my lips, I just outline my natural shape and it really does make such a difference. So just a little bit of liner so we have a base. I'm gonna do half and half. We're gonna do MAC on one half. Okay. You can see a little sparkle. It's definitely balmy. It feels really moisturizing. It feels really moisturizing on. And it has like a little bit of a color has a little bit of a tint to it. Feels very comfortable, feels like a lip gloss on. And now this is the Tarte Maracuja on this side. Okay, this is definitely gliding on better. Oh yeah. I did really good picking out colors that are similar. I think Tarte is the winner of this battle. If you look at the MAC side, this is just kind of sporadic sparkles. Very similar. This, the Maracuja, is more shiny and shimmery and holiday. MAC is more subtle, which in fairness to MAC, MAC is just supposed to be a lip balm. It's not as pigmented, it's not as sparkly. This side is so sheeny and sparkly and that's like what I prefer. Maracuja is the winner, you guys. Let's do Maracuja over everything. Like maybe together they would be good, but oh, you just can't beat the Maracuja formula. You can see how that kind of just took it next level. Oh. I love, love, love. I mean, that is stunning. 
The Maracuja lip products are insane in terms of formula, in terms of how they feel. I am obsessed with them and I just recently, about two months ago, discovered them and I'm like, where have I been this whole time? Because they're so good. I actually, when I ordered my shimmery one, I ordered two others because I was literally out of the ones that I've been using. I love the Lip Plump in Rose, and I'm actually gonna try Primrose this time, and then I also just love their Juicy Lips. I get this in the color Mixed Berries. Oh, I'm obsessed. I definitely think in terms of the face off, the Maracuja Shimmer is more bang for your buck. It feels better on. It has a plumping aspect. I think MAC is good if you just want a subtle chapstick that has a little bit of shimmer to it is what I would say. Whereas this is like, I want one of these in every single color that they carry. And now my champagne look is complete. I hope this video was so helpful. A little bit of insight on what to order in terms of sparkly shimmery lip product this holiday season. This is definitely more like the trendy aesthetic trendy aesthetic you know i'll still use this obviously i just when i'm using a lip product i want it to be like next level shimmer shine sheen beautiful and the maracuja does that for me so winner I hope you baddies found this video helpful and i hope you loved this whole champagne look don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you baddies next time Love me, love me, love me, love me.